I'm from London, just outside London. What part of London? From Hampton. Hampton? Yes, oh, you know, right. Hampton, Hampton Yeah, Port, yeah, 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 yeah. Somewhere between. So yeah. how does, what brings you here? Another printmaker persuaded me the right. first time, that was two years ago. Yeah, yeah. And it's such a lovely fair. So it, um, it's hard to resist. It's just, uh, we call it our little holiday in the lakes. Oh, so good. We do the fair. So you've been before? Been twice before. Twice before? Yeah. What, twice, three times running now? This is the third time, yeah. Right? Yeah. Good. And um, is, it, is it, do you just come because you like the environment or do you actually find you sell stuff? Oh yes, I do. If I didn't sell anything, I wouldn't want to come. Right. But I'm selling London prints, which I sometimes find hard outside Yeah, London. yeah, I can imagine. But if I sell enough to say it's been worth it. Right. Yep. Yeah. So you're paying so, for weekends kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, you're not expecting to make much I'm money, not to get but rich. it pays your expense of coming. And it's often, it's, um, it's a knock-on thing. I've had people sometimes come to me after the fair, yeah, yeah. having found me on the fair's website. So they right. haven't visited, but they've right. looked at the website Good. and then visited me. So it's not necessarily sales at the weekend, no, but no, no. through the rest no, of the no. year. And do you have a website? I've got one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that works, is yeah. it? Yeah. yeah, good. Yeah. I noticed um, prices of the, um, well, the ones that attract me are in the region of 200 upwards. Ooh. And then it starts getting pricey. Yeah, but then, well, it, you know, there's a lot of work. Here. Yeah, I can imagine. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. People don't appreciate. I don't know how much artists cost their time out, but I, I, uh, think, I, I think makers are underpaid if you do it that way. Yeah. Often. Yeah. yeah well, I, I think they'd find it difficult to make ten pounds an hour, wouldn't they? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, it, yeah probably I don't less. Think I'll make ten pounds an hour. No, no, no. <laughs> So oh, if you've got a naught, do you, do you have a, a secondary occupation that keeps you floating? Um, I started off with a part-time job that sort of kept me going, but now it's more the artwork. I run workshops as well. Right. Oh. So. Artworks for whom? For the schools or education? No, adults. Adults. Um, it's just an art. Um, and how are you, do you organise those yourself, to, entirely? Well, it's an art centre, so oh, they yeah. do the bookings. And Good. I go in. Mostly, it's done through them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and it's my local art centre that I do it through. So it's evening workshops for adults. Yeah. And it's rather nice. Yeah. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So you looks like the um, what do they what do they call it? The wheel here, the London Eye, is yes, it? Yes. Yes. And the um, power station and St Saint Paul's. Paul's. Yeah. They're my favourites. Are they? Yeah. Always. Yeah. I just think, for me, they're just such iconic buildings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Structures or whatever in London. So you d do you do them because you like them, or do you yeah. do them because they sell? It's a little bit of both. I, I yeah. wouldn't do it if I didn't like it. No, no. But obviously, if it sells, you're going to do a few more. Yeah, of yeah. course, of course. And that one there is that. Um, that's Westminster. Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. And um, next to it, the Festival Hall, which somebody oh, asked right. me to do. Yeah, yeah. So I've started doing a series on the South Bank. Good. I've got the National Theatre and I've got one that's not with me because it wasn't dry, like the Hayward Gallery. So might you do the reverse? Might you now do some of this area and take them back to London? <laughs> no? Do you know, I would love to, but I just don't have enough time to do everything no, no. I like to do. And do you like rectangular things? Is that yeah. something to do with it? Yeah. Um, well, what I thought, and I think it works, is a little display like that with seats. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. And I think they work better portrait than landscape. I've just never worked square. I don't know, I've just never done it. So it's always been... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've done a few um, landscape views, but mostly I do portrait views. And you go for the general, the same size all the time? Yeah. Yeah. That's partly dictated to me by my working space. Right, yeah, yeah. Um, and my press, I can't do bigger than that really. Bigger right, than that right. And help me understand, is is every print identical or is there some um, slight differences in the different prints? Well, if it's an edition of 25, yeah. in theory they're identical, but if you looked at them all, you might You'd you're, notice you're some, hand down. Yeah, yeah. So you probably would notice some yeah, differences. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. So, uh, to be honest, are there some prints you, you're happy with and others, or they're yeah, all... Yeah, yeah, sometimes I finish something and I don't like it quite as much, or... Yeah. Maybe how I 
posed it or colour combination yeah, yeah, yeah. might not be quite So right. what do you do? You scrap it, do you? Or? If, it, if it's awful, we'll scrap yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it goes up, puts the cost up to the good ones, isn't it? Yeah. There's no point in putting it out if it's no good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I? I'm going to switch to these two. Excuse me. Do you mind if I ask you questions about the work you're looking at? Are you on film? <laughs> yeah. Yeah? yeah. So where have you come from? So we live about just up the road. Up the road. Yeah. So have you have you always come to Print Fest or is it? Uh, we came last year. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're in the, in, renovating our house, so we're just trying to. Yeah, yeah. Trying to find something for the house. And how long have you lived in Alveston? Um, I was actually born in Alveston. Were you? Um, but what I, about? 33 years ago? <laughs> 34 years ago. Oh, well, I've got that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so I've lived here on the land. Right, yeah, All yeah. in the surrounding villages. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, do, you, do you go to land to London regularly? Uh, My brother lives down there. My brother lives down there. We're, We're about. Where is it? Lambeth and Oh, yes. So yeah, he's in, the, he's in the place. So what do you think of the uh, simplicity or...? I think they're great. Yeah. They really do, really like them. Um, we're just the house. Uh, the house we've got what is about 1900s, right? And it's just we're just trying to figure out how it would look in the house, whether it's right. too much for the house. I love art, um, yeah. and I, I live very cheaply in order to be able to afford stuff on you know many other things like that. Yeah, and we're just getting towards the finishing touches on most of the house. Good. So it's just you know trying to find something which will fit. Good. Well, I'll leave you to it then. Thank That's you very much.